So how it works? Let me guide. This is our compressed air tank. You have to fill the compressed air into the supply. Here is the supply. Here you have to do something modification and you have to weld it to connect it properly fit. And you have to supply through a pipe which is uh, supply well. a comp valve, uh, compressed air through which is connected to a motor and you will supply it to a motor through a compressed air. It maximum capacity 100 liter. In our project our capacity is about 200 liter tank. Here is the meter which uh, it indicates the maximum pressure. You have the engine which is drawn by 8 bar and here is the safety valve to protect dangerous from accident and here is some drainage system here right here and here is the uh, dual attachment with meter that supplies and here is the here is the switch that will be on and the compressed air will be supplied so here is the engine and it will be used in our chassis and it is the gear and it is the crank chain and you, it is the total engine and it is the engine oil system and first we have to first you have to supply the compressed air through it and gradually we have to increase the supply pressure then after which gradually we will increase then the supply will be here and then after we have to do something manually force to it like that then after we will change the gear then the engine will start here in the modification is uh, it is the four stroke engine because we have to drive four stroke engine otherwise if you will take two stroke engine the piston may be damaged so we have to take a four stroke engine for more efficiency and more effort so there was more, some modification uh, in generally four stroke engine there is a four stage suction compression condition exhaust and two revelation but in case we have to connect and something changes the modification was when the supply is uh, when inside inlet then the both the valve are closed then when the piston moves TDC to BDC when we will then the pressure by the flywheel then the piston opts to BDC to TDC that means inlet outlet inlet outlet inlet outlet there was the modification and it is very eco-friendly, pollution free and I hope that we will show and how it works 